Hi, I'm Eric Thompson. Welcome to Shaw Cable's coverage of a salute to 25 years of tubbing. The tradition continues. Eight bells and all is well. And Davy Jones's locker. Every year we ran a swim from Nanaimo over to Protection Island there, and Glenn suggested that we uh, float some bathtubs besides the uh, swimmers to give it a little more color. And I thought, well, bathtubs will never float. But he was a very good salesman, so I didn't want to hurt his feelings. So I said, okay, we'll give you a $500 budget. We make a bathtub float, we'll make some and do it. So, my gosh, he got a bathtub to float, and then. He got so enthusiastic. Next thing, he put an engine on the back of the bathtub. With a three to four foot chop and a strong southeasterly wind blowing, weather conditions were less than ideal for the 25th crossing to Vancouver. However, a few more starters than last year were up for the challenge, including 61-year-old Stan Vollmers, who after having won in 68, is ready to assert himself again. Considering the poor weather, a few thousand spectators were still on hand to witness a classic start for the 25th anniversary of the great race. World record holder Dunn finds the going tough and the water cold as he heads out to Entrance Island. Tub 044 with two-time winner Brian Whiteley opens up the throttle and takes a beating. And holding a firm second and close behind is Lee Coax as Dunn is running further south. George Johnson of Nanaimo finds the going tough as the waves have downed a number of tubbers just outside of entrance. Lee Coax is out of the running and is comfortably out of the water and in his escort boat. It's 044, the bootlegger tub all the way and gaining momentum with at least a five minute lead. In second, but not closing the gap, is Kevin Thompson. And behind him, Chris Glenn is having problems trying to hold on to the throttle and get his tub to play. With the wind and wave conditions improving, the sun makes an appearance to shine on the 24-year-old Brian Whiteley, who will make the crossing in one hour, 45 minutes, and 52 seconds, and make his mark in the history books with a triple crown, with wins in 83 and 85. This year's winner of the 1991 Nanaimo to Vancouver bathtub race, Brian Whiteley.